Recently, a lady reached out to me to say that she's been trying to make payments for her Facebook ads but has been unsuccessful because anytime she enters her card details into the payment method, it returns an error message that says that her payment method fails or her card has been declined. Well, I came up with a solution for her and now she's running her ads successfully without any further issues. I know that a lot of people get into this problem because I get this request every now and then. People saying that they can't pay for their ads or they, or they have a payment in their account that cannot be paid because, they are, because Facebook is rejecting their cards. Well, I make money troubleshooting this issue for a lot of people every now and then. But in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you for free how you can resolve common Facebook ads payment issues, especially if you live in Nigeria, so that you can go on to run your ads without any stress. You may experience this issue at the beginning of setting up your ads account. When you select a payment method, you enter your card details, but then you're getting an error message that your card is declined. Or you may also experience this issue after you successfully enter the payment method and your ad has started to run only for you to visit your ads account and you're seeing the error message that your ad account has been disabled because Facebook is not able to debit your card. A lot of people in Nigeria experience this issue because they don't know that they can simply create a prepaid account that allows them to make payments for their ads in Nera using either a Visa or a MasterCard. Because when you opt to enter a payment method, when you select enter a payment method and you enter a card information, you are automatically creating a postpaid ad account. And this can actually result in your ad account being disabled in the future because Facebook won't now be able to debit that card. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you two guaranteed ways that you can use to continually run your Facebook ads successfully without having to worry about any payment issue. But before we go on, hi there, welcome back to my channel. Here we talk about how to make money online and also a lot on sales, marketing and advertising. If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back as always. And if you're new to this channel, you're welcome. Please not leave without subscribing to the channel so that you can become a part of our family and won't miss out when we post similar valuable content like this one. Now let's get back into the tutorial. Now the first method involves getting a bank card type that would help you to pay or clear off your outstanding payments and also help you to, you know, add a successful payments method so that whether you want to use a postpaid or a prepaid ad account, you will be able to do that successfully, right? And the bank card that I'm talking about is the Providence Bank card. They are actually of two types. We have the Platinum MasterCard and the Classic MasterCard. The Platinum MasterCard costs about 5,000 Naira to get, while the Classic MasterCard costs just about 1,000 Naira. Also, the Platinum MasterCard can allow you to make up to $3,000 transaction in a month, while the other one allows you to do only about $1,200 transactions in a month. All you simply need to do in order to get this card is to walk into any providers bank close to you and request to get any of this card type after you fund it you can now go to your ads account and then enter the card details as your payment method this will then clear off your outstanding payments and you can now continuously use this card to run your ads so anytime you run ads facebook will then debit this card to pay for your ads but if you don't want to go through getting the providers card you can now go through the second method that i'm going to be showing you which is to create an entirely new ads account and then you would have to abandon the other ad account that is having payment issues so let's get into my laptop screen and i'll show you how to create a new ads account so the next method i'm going to be showing you is to create another ads account in case you don't want to pay off that debt or you don't even have the time or the energy to go to Providence Bank to get the cards that I've talked about, right? So just come to your ads account and navigate to your business settings, right? So click on business settings. And I'm going to be creating a new ads account that would allow you to make your payment in Nera using a payment platform called PayU. So with PayU, you can pay for your ads with a Visa card or a MasterCard of any bank. Now we are on the business manager of this particular Facebook profile. So if you don't know how I got here, it's Pretty simple. So when you get to your ads account, whether you're logged in on your mobile phone or on your laptop, just come click on this three um, line you're seeing here. Click on it and then it's going to drop down some menu options. Then you're going to be seeing business settings. So click on business settings and it will bring you straight into this interface that I am currently on. All right. So because of my network, it's not very fast. So it's going to bring you here. And what we want to do is to create another ads account. So I'll click on ads account. 
and because this particular um business manager does not yet have any ads accounts it's showing no ads account found try a different search or fewer filters so what i'm going to do is to create a new ads account so i'll click on add so it's going to be giving us three options here we have the option to create a new ad account claim an existing ad account or request to share an ad account so i'll just come to create a new ad account and then we're going to go on to enter the details so this is where you have to pay attention to right the first thing you even have to pay attention to is the currency if you go on to create a um a dollar account you might have issues because you don't have a dollar card to make the payment in right so i'll come here and i'll enter the name so i'll say for instance then our time zone i'll select the time zone which is going to be um, GMT plus one, right? GMT plus one. Oh, where's the time? Well, let me just search for Lagos time. Lagos. All right. Great. So this is the time zone you want to be using, right? GMC plus one, Africa slash Lagos, right? Then make sure that this is selected as NERA, all right? This is really very important. If you want to use the prepaid ads account and be able to fund your ads in NERA without any issues, make sure that you select the Nigerian ads account or the Nigerian currency. Then click on next. Then it will ask you what you want to use the account for. So who will this ad account be used for? This ad account will be used for my business. Just click on my business and go to next. Then it says, are you sure you want to continue? This The ad account will be created and added with Pretty Stone Business Portfolio. Your request, Pretty Stone. And yeah, this is the this is the business portfolio or the business manager name. The, you know, business manager um have been renamed business portfolio now, right? So don't don't get confused. So it's still the same thing, business manager, business portfolio. So what this simply means is that this business portfolio would be the one, you know, having this um ads account inside, right? So just go on to um you know check out this other one that says ad account access once created business admins with full control of this business port portfolio will also be able to manage the ad accounts just come here and click on i agree to meta terms of service and all that then click on create ad accounts then the next thing we're going to be doing is to set the payments method and this is where a lot of people get it wrong all right so it says ad account created successfully the pretty stones to ad account has been created and added to the pretty stones business portfolio now would you like to add payment info for your accounts so let's go on ahead to add payment info all of this is already automatically checked in that's the country the currency and the time zone click on next And then guys you want to make sure to check nera payments with mastercard or visa pay you all right if you check this and you enter any bank information you will still have the same issue you were having because most times facebook will not be able to debit your nigerian card all right except you're going to be getting the providence bank card that i've talked about if you've got if you've gotten the providence bank card and you still want to go on ahead with the prepaid account you can actually still come here and add the payments method and um, instead of this one right so just come here and click on nera payments with mastercard so once you've made payments right once you've made um an initial deposit with this nera payments with mastercard it activates your prepaid account then you can go on whenever you want to fund your account or whenever you want to run ads you can just fund the account with how much you want to start with and then go on to set up your ad your ad will run with the prepaid funds that you have in your ads account all right so the difference is that when you enter a debit or credit card your ad is going to run without any funds in your ads account after your ad have run to um it has gotten to a particular payment threshold facebook will now seek to debit the card that you enter the details for they will not seek to debit or remove that money from that um card but when it is not able to debit the card that is when you now start having that credit balance on your ad account and then your ad account become disabled right except you've gotten the previous um card type that i've talked about you will still have that issue of your ad account being disabled because you're not able to make the outstanding payments all right you can just skip this method and then follow the next 
method to go on to create your um to fund your ads account from here it's really very simple you would need to enter your card details and then go on to um you know get the otp from your bank and then simply fund your ad so here you're going to be adding the amount you want to fund so let's say you just want to fund with a little amount right so that you can just establish that this is actually working you can just go and fund it with this um with a simple amount say 500 naira um and then check your billings and payments and the money is going to be reflecting there then you can now go on to set your ads after you set up your ads you can now come back and fund the account again all right so let me show you how to do that so let's say for instance you've already added the funds from here so click on this three horizontal line again and then you will now see billings and payments so click on billings and payments and you will see where you're going to be able to add funds using the pay you method all right let's check that out so this is your billings and payments um interface so whenever you want to add funds you can just come here and click on add funds and check the nera payments with mastercard or visa as simple as that then go on to you know make your payments and then the money would reflect here so all the payments you made are going to be reflecting here all right more like much like your payments history thank you very much for staying until the end of this tutorial i have no doubt that you've gained immense value from all that i've shared if you're yet to subscribe to this channel i wonder what you're waiting for please hit on the subscribe button so that you'll become a member of our family and you won't miss out whenever we post similar content like this one showing you how to resolve issues like this in the online space bringing you closer to achieving your financial goals thank you very much and i'll see you in the next tutorial